hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i am just it's my day off and yesterday was the beginning of british summertime so we are now like an hour ahead and pretty much i feel like i'm so tired because it's like you know when it feels like you've lost an hour of sleep and such but hey today is my only day off for this week and i am gonna be working my four days back to back coming up so there are a few things that i need on the road so i just need to um run and get those and need i say today is march 29 so we're i think like in the second um phase of the phased reopening um in the uk so beginning today like two families can meet like outdoor and what else i think up to like six people can meet outdoors you know like in parks and such and you can also um do like outdoor sporting activities like swimming or cricket or whatever whatever um games that can be played outdoors and stuff like that so things are really looking up um in terms of getting out of this whole lockdown i mean other i've been following the news with the whole lockdowns in jamaica and stuff like that and you know when you're used to your freedom and then you feel like it you have to be in so much restrictions and know exactly what that feels like i've been in lockdown i've been in lockdown um pretty much the only places that are open are like you know like food places supermarkets and places where you really get essentials and stuff like that so i know what that feels like to be in so much restriction and stuff like that and for things to be looking up now it's really um a good thing yeah so i'm just gonna be just taking a stroll outside to the um food store to get a few items that i need and um a couple of other household items and then i'll be right back in because it's my only day off it's my only day off i don't like to spend too much time outside because i feel like you now it's literally like after 12 already so i feel like the day is already done but um hopefully i'll get this video up by later because it won't be very long and i've been trying for the longest while to film you know like a day in the life of a nurse kind of video but trust me it's it's not easy it is really not easy to film those kind of videos because it takes a lot of dedication because sometimes what happens is that i end up getting up at the exact time and i don't have enough time to film and filming takes time you know like to slot in times when you're gonna get clips of certain things and whatever it can be really time consuming so i haven't really gotten there as yet but i'm still gonna try i know this week i have my four days back to back so maybe i'll probably attempt to get some clips and if i'm successful you'll see that next week but pretty much i haven't posted in a while because sometimes it really gets monotonous going to the supermarket you're just taking a stroll outside pretty much that's it and i'm alone in the house so there's no really no excitement so sometimes you'd get up and there's really no vibe to film because what are you gonna film and such and then as it relates to my nursing videos yes i have plans for those but then it does take time to put those content together because i'm gonna be putting forward my experience i'm not gonna put in forward anybody else's experience so it does take time for all of that to be compiled together and stuff like that so yeah so pretty much today as i said just a chill day and i'll just take you along with me just show you little clips here and there of what my day off is like and yeah so i hope you enjoy and if you're not yet subscribed to the channel what are you waiting on i mean i know some people just enjoy in uh, i mean enjoy seeing what other people's day are like and stuff but for what i promise to bring you know fun things about traveling nursing cooking a little bit of everything um if you're interested in that go ahead 
hit the subscribe button it's free to join there's no cost and i really enjoy everyone who take the time out each and every time to watch my videos to comment on my videos to like my videos to share my videos and oh need i say i'm at the place um well initially i had put up a video some time ago I don't think much persons really took note of that or they thought I was joking or something like that. I did have intentions of doing a giveaway in the first week of April. Um, hopefully, I thought, you know, probably I would have hit my thousand subs by then and such. But even though that has not happened, I am still going to do a giveaway nonetheless. Because, I mean, I have people riding, riding with me from day one and i just thought it would be nice just to show my appreciation to say i appreciate having you here i appreciate you you know taking the time out to watch my videos um to share my videos and stuff like that so i'm gonna be doing a random giveaway in the first week of april i don't have an exact date as yet but i'm gonna have a random giveaway in the first week of april all right what the giveaway is will be will be a surprise because the giveaway will be depending on where um the individual is located whichever country you are so not every giveaway would be suitable for certain persons right so yeah depends on where the person is um that will determine what they will get as the prize so yeah look forward for that stay tuned for my giveaway all right, so I hope you enjoy this video once again. It's so windy. Listen, I am still cold, so still I put on my hat and thing. <laughs> yeah, no matter what time of the summertime, the year. I'm still cold for right now. And as usual, my eyes still are on water. I want to put on my glasses, but kind of too dark. I probably need to get something lighter so we can wear outside since it's not that sunny but it's just a matter of getting the wind out my eyes and thing i am at the bus stop yeah i guess for somebody living here this might be too much clothing but for me it is just fine i'm not from here i cannot manage this with a small my blows this hoodie underneath and my jacket over yeah that's the fit it's better for me to be warm than to be cold welcome to the reality of where we don't know we didn't know that we would actually enjoy going to the supermarket <laughs> till we in lockdown and that's the only place to go really yeah supermarket here we come <laughs> So I'm actually at another bus stop because the bus stop where I was, I missed the bus by a few seconds. So I literally had to walk to another bus stop. So that's where I'm at now, right now. I'm just sitting and waiting patiently. The bus should be here in another two minutes or so. It's better to be early than to be late because hey, these buses are not waiting on you. You're late, you're late. So I'm off the bus and I'm heading to the town center. Pretty much the town center is not going to be busy today because most places are still not open. But there are a few places that will be open. Like, as I said, just like supermarket or if it sells household items, pharmacies, etc. So pretty much, yeah. I'm going to go in Wilco to get some also items and such so pretty much wilco is like this that sells every little thing also items and such uh, yeah i don't think i'll show you everything but just a glimpse of stuff I'm gonna get this one. 
need a microwave, I need a copper effect. So I may come back and get this, but not today. Um, I need a blender, so I'm gonna look to see if they do have any blenders. Pots and pans and stuff. I know I need a big pot, but I don't need it today, so I'll just pass on that for today, but I do need a blender. So I'm looking for that. Oh, they have a hand blender. Um, I think I need something a little bigger than that. Yeah. Just for making smoothies and stuff, but I need something bigger than that. So, still gonna look around. I have so much bottles because everywhere I go, I see nice bottles. I always buy these, are so cute. I'm gonna get this cutler set. I already have cutlers, but you know, sometimes it don't hurt to have like a little extra. So, I'm not getting anything too fancy because, as I said, I already have, but I'm just getting like some extras. Done inside Wilco, and I'm gonna go to BM. I didn't get the blender in uh, Wilco, so I'm gonna try BM for that. If not, I'll just get it online. BM is kind of multi faceted, like um, it does like food stuff and it has some also items. Also, I have milk literally one pound, you can get up a 69p or 49p, depends on which size you want. Growing up when I used to love these things, oh my god, I used to love um oval tea, but I didn't really like the taste again. And Orlix, but I don't think it was this Orlix that I used to get because I don't really like too much chocolate stuff. It's for a dollar seventeen, um, one pound seventy nine, but I'm not really so much into chocolate stuff, so I'm not gonna get it. Okay, you basically can get anything you want, food items. Breakfast items, um, snacks, groceries, everything you want. I need bread, but I don't need it inside here. I need a bread, like more so from the supermarket. Anakin girl, but I'm excited when I see Familia stuff. It's for $9.99, and then it's two for $2.99, but I'm not really an Anakin girl. For me, the thing I just saw Smirnoff Ice and Red Stripe. Born in Jamaica. 13.99 pounds for the 24 cans but i don't need red stripe i don't really do red stripe so i'm now back to my blender on tin and i think i'm gonna get one of these because they look much more um multi-purpose so yeah i'm gonna get me one of these i pretty much have something like this like a handheld um one but that's just like for an undergo kind of thing I need something more you know sturdy this really too small i don't need that um i more need something like this i'm gonna get one of those three tier steamers but i'm not gonna get it today i'll get this another day and do need a blender yeah more blender i do need a microwave but i'm not gonna get that today either life i don't need a fan i don't know if when the summer gets hot i will need it but for right now i definitely don't so of course i had to stop filming because i end up with so much stuff so i'm done i'm in the parking lot of the um the shopping center i'm gonna get an uber because i have too much things to take so i'm just gonna get an uber and then i go home so welcome back guys i am now back home from my little um run to the store to get some items well the main reason i went out is because i needed bread and i needed the blender but 
was a couple of the items. Yeah, I know this wasn't here the last time I did this video. <laughs> like, I bought a whole house thing. Um, at some point, I guess, when I'm finished or when I'm close to finish, I'll just do a little um, house tour, maybe. Maybe not everything, but just show you some of the ideas. Yeah, so I got this um, natural color um, sofa set. Well, it wasn't really a set. There's like a two-seater and this is like a single-seater. Um, so because in here is, you know, the walls are white and everything is pretty much white, I decided that I need, you know, a little color in it. So I got some yellow cushions and I had some extra ones. So I just, just popped this one right here. But yeah, that's not a video for it today, but um i got this multi blender it's 18 one um when i'm gonna unbox this i'll definitely do a video unboxing this um yeah so i got that um i saw this single duvet set because i think i'm gonna get a single bed for my daughter so i got this um duvet set i think it is so cute um she said her favorite color is pink and purple so this is like pink background with you know a few other colors on it but it's really nice i like it um this was like for 12 pounds um yeah so it's the duvet cover and a single pillowcase it's really nice you know i start buying little stuff from now so when the time actually comes, it doesn't actually feel too pressuring when I have to buy everything. Um, I saw this little thing that says home sweet home. It's just a little decor item. I think I'll find somewhere to put it. Yeah, but I think it was really nice. So I got this. Um, I also saw this little hanging um, wall decor that says all you need is love and that is so true so i got this um oh let me tell you prices if you want to know this was like for two pounds um this is for one pound 99 um it's really nice i'll i'll find definitely find somewhere to put this the only thing is that i wish there was another color because because the walls are white and then this is white so um but the writing on it will um bring out the beauty and then because it's hard shape yeah it's not that bad um i got some command strips because um not really allowed to make any alterations or drill any holes or stuff like that so i got some um command strips to put those little decor pieces on not really doing much to the walls. I'm not really hanging much and stuff like that. Not really into four um, plants. But I thought these are really cute. And I got two pieces of, what should I say, furniture since I last did my, my, uh, my home tour. And these would be really nice on it. So I got them. I didn't want it too big because based on the space that I have. But they're really nice. It looks real, but they're four, so there's like two pounds each. And the white is okay because um, it's like a little cube shelf kind of thing, and it's black, so this will definitely um, come out on that. Yeah, I got those stuff in a B and M. <clears throat> I got this. Um, what's what's this? A four bar radiator era um you know sometimes not everything you want to put in the dryer to dry so this is like a little four bar wrap that i can hang like right at the radiator and allow some things to just air dry so i didn't want it too big yeah and cumbersome so this is pretty much fine this was just i think for the price is not on it but i think this was for like three pounds 
I'll put that in really cool. Um, I like to put this in my laundry. It's Lenore Unstoppable In Wash Scent Boosters. This was like on sale, and this is in the fragrance active by and it's recommended by Ariel. This is really nice. Like when you squeeze the top, you can actually smell it. It's really nice. This was like on sale for three pounds. It, it's actually usually six pounds, but it was on sale for three pounds. So that was like a win-win for me. I got these um 16 piece cutlery set. I do have cutlery because um I really went for like rose gold for my kitchen. Um, so I have cutlery in the tone rose gold, but I just um basically got these as some extras because you know sometimes i guess at some point maybe in the future if i have people over and um i only basically had one set or a set is like four so i got you know like these extras just in case i need extra colors um this is a little star shape is it star shape yeah star shape bowl um don't ask me what I bought it for. It was on sale. <laughs> it was for five pounds and then it was reduced to two pounds fifty. Um, I think I'll probably um it can probably do anything, it's like multi-purpose, like for decor. Um, but I probably can put like sweets in this and put it like um on my center table, or like I have this little table right at the couch. Um, so I can put little sweets, trinkets, and a little thing inside there, but I really liked it, so I bought it just for decor purposes. And I always like I'm always writing, so I just got these little pens, different colors, um, to do stuff. Um, I needed a Listerine, I got a Listerine, Colgate Listerine, and you yeah, about Listerine, a mouthwash, because Listerine is a brand. Yeah, I need use that mouthwash. So I got a Colgate brand. Yeah, and I got this Febreze fabric freshener. This was like, I think, one pound. Yeah, this was one pound. I think one pound fifty. You know, sometimes you just want to freshen like your um, your probably your your cushions, any little thing that you don't want to wash um as often or if you just want yeah just to fresh up your cushions your pillows um anything like that yeah i got that and that's all for my little household items um i did get a couple of few food items which i'll show you in another clip now i'm just quickly gonna show you the other stuff that i got um and then i'll just leave them on the counter because some things you know you need to wipe them off and such um i got this fairy um dishwashing liquid um it's very concentrated this can serve me for a very long time um i really like to use these i started re using them lately instead of using um laundry detergent and stuff like that um these are some all-in-one pods this is by ariel there are other brands but i really like how this one smell so pretty much um i use this for my laundry um yeah they're really nice let me just show you what it's looking like see if i can open it yeah Ugh. now that i got it open so this is what it's looking like it's like some all-in-one parts so it, it basically has um everything that you need to wash inside there so it's like the laundry detergent and fabric softener and whatever else is in there um but they're really smelling um so good so i use this for my laundry yeah and i saw this so i got this this smirnoff mixed vodka mixed drink um i'll see how this tastes because i've never really seen it like this so i'll definitely have a try and see what that's like um as i said the main purpose of going out was to get bread but hey eventually i did this is a um soft tiger bloomer thicker slice warburton's bread so yeah 
some bread and then i've also got these cinnamon with raisin fruit loaf so it's just like a bread but it tastes really good like you can actually have this just by itself it tastes like a bun um pretty much yeah i got some oreo vanilla flavor yogurt i hope this are really good let me open it and see what it's like inside okay so i guess one side is the yogurt and the other side is the cookie pieces that you would sprinkle on it um these are quite convenient because i can actually bring these to work um so it's like four in the pack really good these are just some cadbury cream eggs these are like a snack like that you for something sweet um, this is just a little slice of cake i got this nesquik wake up your milk this is like something that you can just um use to get some strawberry flavor for your um like if you're making some milkshake or something um i saw these protein shake that i'm probably gonna try and substitute for meals sometimes so like maybe sometime like skip lunch have a shake or something like that or if i want to have it like in the morning i've got three different flavors i've got um chocolate flavor cookies and cream and i got a strawberry flavor i also got um this milk i didn't want it too big because milk usually go bad very quickly for me because i don't um really like to use too much um milk so i got this because i plan to make a lot of smoothies now that i have my blender and sometimes i need milk for the base um i got this salt and pepper mini mason jar shakers um i think i'll put these like so like on the table um i'll put these on the table it's like in some little mini jars they're so super cool yeah so it has the s on top that says it's salt and this one with p on top that says it's pepper i'll put these on the table the jars are super cute yeah i think that was just like a pound something like a one pound 79 and i got this um chili and garlic salt i like this pretty much put it on everything and i got a black pepper just for cooking purpose because the other one i said is for the table so that's why it's for cooking purpose and i just needed a little condensed milk um sometimes i'm making porridge and i just need um some condensed milk i got some unsmoked bacon um just for breakfast and two slices of gabon steak yeah sometimes you just want something different no chicken no fish yeah so that's pretty much it just a little quick um right to the store to grab a few items just to top up on some things i pretty much have everything else i need yeah so once again guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video